Hello, my beautiful Cancer friends. How are you? Welcome back to Sacred Knowledge Tarot. I'm so happy and excited to have you all here today. And those of you that are brand new to my channel, hello and welcome, my friends. My name is Ria, and I do these readings every week. Now, Cancer, this is a general reading for you, so I do please ask that you take what resonates and leave what doesn't. And if any one of you are interested in a personal reading with me, my information is in the description box below for you. All right, Cancer, make sure you check out your Moon, Rising, and Venus signs as well. I'm now going to pull three cards out of my tarot deck and we're going to find out what message spirit has for you today. All right. Wow. Look at this. You are receiving the wheel of fortune here. So my friends, your fortune is about to change. Wow. Life is going to take a different turn here for you. And look at this. We've got the ace of wands. So something new is definitely coming in. Wow, this is beautiful energy here, Cancer. Page of Pentacles. So look at this. This is all amazing because there's so much good news and good things coming into your lives here, Cancer. Okay, so give me a minute here while I take a look at your cards and see what my intuition draws in. So the Wheel of Fortune. Hmm... Yeah, so I feel like there's going to be a change in your situation here, okay, in a big way here. And I feel whatever this change is, it's really going to change your luck. It's going to change your destiny. And I feel for some of you, this is you doing this, okay? This is you manifesting this into your world. And with the Ace of Wands being present, this is a, an idea or some sort of a project, a creative project or something that you are doing that you're going to bring into this world. This is like you planting a seed. Seed. Okay, so whatever this change is, it's bringing in this new project, this new opportunity, this new adventure that you are going to be embarking on. And boy, oh boy, is it going to be good here, my friends. I feel this is really going to give you a new lease on life here, okay? Um, whatever this idea is, this could be you building a home. This could be you starting a YouTube channel. This could be you finding a different job, finding that career path. This could be you building your career, right? Um, meaning like at home, your home business, really following your passion and doing what it is that you truly love to do and enjoy doing, right? I feel for some of you, you're at this point in your life where you definitely need a change. And whether you know this or not, the universe is on your side here and it's helping things change. So I feel for some of you, you're going to quit your jobs okay and follow your passions and for others I feel you are moving up in your careers okay there's going to be a change in where you're at currently and this is going to happen very quickly here okay and from that is going to come that spark that idea whatever this is for you it's really going to um, put you on this brand new path and along comes some good news with your finances, right? This could be you wanting to get a loan. Maybe you're wanting to uh, gain some finances in order to work on a project and you're going to have somebody either offer you some money or you're going to be approved uh, from the bank, right? Or something like that. But I do feel there is some news coming in around your finances here. This could be you um, learning something brand new and you using that in order to grow financially, right? This could be you, um, yeah, uh, taking up some new skills really to put something under your belt here more and stretch your resources out, right? And this is, I feel like this is coming in through somebody, right? This is somebody bringing you a message and look at this. We've got cards jumping out today. We've got another page card, so the page of cups. And here, this is new skills, like I was saying, the new skills, really tapping into that inner child, right? Uh, experiencing whatever it is that you're doing right now with curiosity and not using any manuals or guidebooks, right? This is Spirit Guides really wanting you to explore what it is that you want to do with uh, a different uh, set of eyes, right? Um, it's like looking at... A box of Legos right without instructions without any pictures and really creating something with your own mind and your own heart right and this is what spirit guides really want you to tap into especially those of you that are trying to embark on your own uh, passion project right seven of cups are coming in so decisions there's a lot of decisions you're going to have to make and here spirit guides want you to focus in on making higher self choices right what is right 
some you know and and really making choice out of love and uh not what other people think i feel also to um we've got this one coming out eight of wands jumping out at us so time to dedicate yourself and devote you yourself to your work my friends putting in that hard work and really doing what i feel like a lot of you cancers need to follow your passion okay do what it is that you love okay in this next chapter of your life i i just feel that not not a lot of us uh are able to follow our passions we just have these fears and blockages and like limiting beliefs and doubts about ourselves where we're not able to, to even move forward right some of us are paralyzed by our fears and here spirit guides are letting you know uh cancer that your destiny is about to change luck is on your side you have spirit guides guiding you at this time really letting you know that it's time to follow your passion it's fault time to follow what you love do what you love and really um come to this place where you're now making a living doing what you love and you know do it as a side hustle to start if it's not going to work out for you financially but i feel that if you devote yourself to it give yourself a little bit of time to do this that it's going to work out for you and you know i did the exact same thing you know i was afraid to leave my day job right um but I did it cold turkey. I actually saved some money first, obviously, right? To work, to be able to be off for at least six months. So I had my rent covered, right? I saved to have six months of rent covered, saved to have my bills, my phone bill, my car payment, all of that. So I was good. I'm like, okay, I'm going to take six months off and really work to make my YouTube channel grow to do these readings because I want to make a difference in the world, right? I really want to motivate everyone out there to do what it is that you truly enjoy doing because it's possible it's all up to you and here in your reading cancer spirit guides really want you to follow your passion those of you that are starting maybe start it as a side hustle but look there's so much coming in and with hard work and dedication is going to come abundance all of that is going to trickle in behind you okay it's all about you focusing your energy on where it is that you want to be especially if you're not feeling good at where you're at right now is you know it's time to move to that place that is going to bring you happiness and joy that place of satisfaction and fulfillment and it's all about how much work you're willing to put in to get to that place right this is what the eight of wands is all about and i feel for some of you you're going to see progress in your life and you're really going to see that freedom and that excitement coming through right and this is all what this is what it is i feel for some of you cancers is all about your you know financial freedom that personal independence that place where you can feel free to do what it is that you want without having any kind of boundaries or restrictions put on you right and this is where the energy wants you to flow in this direction they really want you spirit guides really want you to focus in on following your passion and being on that in that place or walking down that road that is meant for you and only you can tell me what that is right but i feel that you're really on the brink of something here okay your life is about to shift in a really big way and I feel you need to embrace this energy that is coming in making higher self choices really focusing in on shifting that mindset as well and looking at your life a little bit differently right um, I'm feeling like positivity needs to be a focus in your life and you know shifting that mindset from scarcity to abundance because that's where everything is going to start shifting right it's as soon as you shift your thoughts that's what's going to shift in your reality if you remain in the same place nothing is going to change right change has to happen within you in order for it to happen in your reality so here going forward cancer it's all about the choices that you make going forward with your decisions right is it benefiting you is it coming from a place of love right is this for your higher self or are you looking around at the, what people are thinking about you is it going to benefit me or is it going to benefit this person or what are they going to think of me if i make this choice right so spirit guides really want you to focus on yourself okay what is going to benefit you you are the one that's going to be able to create this reality for yourself if you want it i'm going to pull a couple more cards spirit guides are asking me to pull some more cards because i feel there is another message here for you dedicate yourself to your work dedicate to yourself to your passion here cancer because i feel for some of you you're hearing that voice you're hearing that calling and this is your confirmation through this reading today that you're meant to follow that path 
Look at this, the Knight of Pentacles. Take that action, okay? You need to stay. take action steps towards those goals here, right? I'm going to move that over here. So, Knight of Pentacles, I feel that you are determined. And I know that you know that you have all the tools in order to make this happen, make this dream come true, right? Dedicate yourself. I feel for some of you, you are determined to get to that place that you want to be in, like, say, 10 years, right? I feel that's not going to take you 10 years to get there. I think, think the time period is way shorter, right? Especially if you're going to put your hard work and dedicate and devote yourself to that. I feel you have that passion within you. You have that fire burning within you in order to really get to that place. And, you know, listen to that voice inside of yourself that is telling you to really push through and move forward in that direction that you want to go. Not to listen to any of the influences around you. Spirit guides are also letting me know that some of you need to uh, release yourself from... Um, energy that's coming in from social media okay there's like comparisons happening i'm seeing comparisons here through your tarot cards that you're comparing yourselves to other people and you know you're not in competition with anyone you're only in competition with yourself okay and I listen to a lot of the celebrities, a lot of the music artists, and they say the same thing, right? They're in the place that they're at because they wanted to be their true selves and be, you know, and there's all these different influences and there's haters, there's lovers, there's all these things you have to deal with, right? And they were normal people. They were working out of their garage at one point, then rose and grew to this, this height. And I feel for you, Cancer, you're being called to do something, okay? You, you have what it takes. You really do. And you need to devote yourself to that passion, whatever it is, especially those of you that are wanting to follow that path, right? To believe in yourself in order to accomplish accomplish those goals because you have it in you to do this my friends you do and uh, spirit guides are sending some of you signs to see the path to see the you know to see the way they're shedding light on it and some of you are seeing it some of you aren't right make yourself aware to the signs from the universe here my friends there are so many signs and your manifestations start manifesting you know be very clear with your decision making here um, your decision making, right? It's page of cups. Usually the page, do we have the page of pentacles here as well? You have this, these cards, right? So spirit guides are sending you signs. They're coming in as messengers, letting you know to follow that path that you're meant to be on. And, you know, I know within you, some of you are really feeling it very strongly, but there's almost like something holding you back, whatever this is, whether it's you telling yourself stories, limiting beliefs or self doubts, or people telling you there's no way that can happen. Happen, why not why can't it happen or that can't be done this can't be done why can't it why can't you be the one to show them that it can happen right so this is your message here cancer spirit guides really want you to focus your attention on following your passions and doing what you love because once you start doing that that's where abundance follows okay and devoting yourself to that that is all it takes and you will see how far you will rise my friends it is unbelievable so this is your reading for today if it resonates please comment below hit that like button and if you're brand new to my channel you're enjoying my content please consider subscribing other than that, I wanted to wish you all a beautiful day and thank you so much for watching.